The Amnesty International Greetings Card campaign is designed to send messages of support and solidarity to people who are imprisoned or threatened all over the world. These people have been abused or they are under threat of abuse and have been chosen by Amnesty International. We in St Michael's began, I think, supporting this campaign in the early 1990s. And since then, every year we have gathered in the church and after the service to sign cards, Christmas cards sometimes, but postcards as well, to send to people who's, who are really suffering from injustice. We know that the cards do good. We know this because sometimes prisoners are released and they tell their stories of how they were imprisoned and how sacks of mail would come and in some cases they would get their clothes back and then they would get better food. And recently uh, a poet in the Sudan, a man called Majub Sharif, was released. And when he contacted Amnesty International, this is what he said. These cards came from people from all over, people I have not seen and who have not seen me. They wrote the cards, they went out and bought stamps. It was because of these people that I became a braver person. It made a big difference in prison. The guards saw that if anything happened to me, the world would know. And at home, his wife and his family were also aware of the cards arriving. And his wife said, it was beyond happiness to see the cards. They made us feel supported for all the prisoners and their families. And for me and my daughters, they gave us so much hope. And hope is the message that we send out some 300 or so cards every Christmas, every November. And that's the message we, I hope we continue to send.